Oh yeah. Beg, you switch peasants. started with this video you know the spiel give it a thumbs up broski why not broski you know you want to homie like all right we have some dope nintendo switch news items for this video the first one i ain't too proud to beg now y'all remember that song tlc come on bro i'm old capcom wants you to beg you want their games on the switch bow down you switch peasants in an interview with egx i'm capcom street fighter producer yoshinori ono you know the dude with the orange hair that has a bubbly personality <laughs> he uh, he responded to a fan asking if they were planning on beating, bringing street fighter 4 and 5 to the nintendo switch this is his reply <laughs> you better beg he says can you go over to the nintendo booth and maybe just ask, like, shout out that to, at the VIPs in the backstage. Because there's the one you really need to talk to, not me. He goes on. Even our previous Nintendo title, Ultra Street Fighter 2, Nintendo came to us and said we want to do something with Street Fighter 2. Because it's been 25 years since it came out on previous Nintendo consoles. So, I think they're the ones you need to convince. So, go and mob that booth. He's saying, we ain't going to Nintendo. Nintendo got to come to us, bro. They want our games. Beg for it. First of all, y'all put Street Fighter 4 on the, on the 3DS. And it was a real good port. I mean, bro, I was surprised. Street Fighter 4 was a launch title on the 3DS. I got it at launch. Bro, I picked them up, bro. I still got my 3DS, bro. And it was good. Bro, they act like Street Fighter um, 2, we got the 30th anniversary, we got the new challengers, both decent games, but they were really ports of old arcade games, bro. Capcom is tripping. Street Fighter 5 would be lit on the Switch, bro. They act like Street Fighter 5 was selling in Gang Bus. I remember when Street Fighter 5 launched. The game was tanking hard, bro. Street Fighter is my favorite fighting series. And it's a shame we don't got any new Street Fighter games on the Switch. I know Sony had the Street Fighter 5 exclusive, but that had to be a time. To I'm surprised it ain't even coming on the Xbox yet. The next Street Fighter game. Make it a multi-plat release, cross-play, something lit. Street Fighter V on the Switch is a no-brainer, but Capcom is tripping. They're like, y'all want the game? Big. And they've done these shenanigans before, bro. <laughs> they said something like this before with, like, the Resident Evil. Now we're getting all the Resident Evil games, old ports, um, and other games, too. Capcom, they ain't even put Monster Hunter on the Switch yet, a new Monster Hunter game. They gave us a 3DS port of Monster Hunter. Crapcom is tripping. That's right. I said C-R-A-P. Point. All right, next news item. The Overwatch 2 rumors are hot. How hot? Fire is everywhere. My favorite special effects. Oh, it's heating up. And where there's smoke. There is fire. We're gonna keep the fire up for the rest of this video. Why? Because this video is lit, boy. Um, this is bro, and this is a crazy source from ESPN.com. That's right, ESPN is talking about Overwatch. Why? Because <coughs> Overwatch is big in esports. Esports is the wave right now, bro. Millions and millions of dollars. And so, coming from ESPN.com. Um, Blizzard is set to unveil 
Um, and I reported on this before from another leaker, but now this is coming from more sources that um, Overwatch 2 will be revealed at BlizzCon. It will feature, uh, it's a new logo. Hey, y'all want to see the logo? I got you, boys and hey, girls. That's not it. That's my bro at the end of the video. Here it is. This is the logo for um, Overwatch 2. It's set to have, I like it. I like how the little 2 wraps around the O lit. It's set to have a new logo, which I can see right there. New game modes, maps, heroes, and p player versus everything um, features at BlizzCon this week. And so this was leaked through a 2019 demo guide based um, obtained by ESPN. And so <coughs> Overwatch 2 is real, ladies and gentlemen. Expect some news um, this week. Big question for me is, is it coming to the Switch? We just got Overwatch on the Switch. This is the Switch footage, and I'm liking the game. I've fallen back in love with Overwatch motion aiming, bruh. See, I've heard people complaining about the motion aiming Overwatch. First, you can adjust the sensitivity to your liking. But I play with Splatoon at that max sensitivity, so I'm used to it being quick and loose. For me, it's better with aiming, and so uh, I like motion aiming, bro. Nintendo, always have motion aiming in your future future um, uh, controllers. But um, Overwatch 2 is real. Hopefully, the game not just launches on the Switch, but launches at launch date on the Switch. We got NBA 2K at launch. We got a couple other um, big titles at launch, but we got a couple after more, more AAA games after launch than before. So hopefully um, Overwatch is one of those um, AAA games that launches when the other games launches. I'm anticipating this is gonna be probably a 2020 um, title. So Overwatch 2, let's go. Next news item. Elder Scrolls Blades, which is set to come to the Switch fall this any day now. We'll get a launch date. Or do we? Already, I couldn't find a launch date. This trailer just says fall, and it's set to be an online only game. Some controversy because the Switch is a portable console. Really, my Switch wherever I go is always online because I have a hotspot um, on my phone. Um, you have always online games. Overwatch. It's an always online game. Splatoon 2, one of Nintendo's biggest IPs on the Switch. It's an online only game. So I don't, I don't really see the big issue. Um, I don't even know if I'm going to get this game. Not really my cup of tea. But um, if you're planning on playing this game, you have to always be connected online. Next news item. I thought this was pretty cool. For my UK subs, bro. We, got, we global, bro. We international. I got subscribers everywhere. Bro. If you're in the UK, you can get a free Nintendo Switch Lite with your next smartphone purchase. Mobiles.co.uk is offering a Nintendo Switch Lite for customers purchasing a selected smartphone. Bro, you talking about a big incentive to get a uh, free Nintendo Switch Lite to sign up for a, a smartphone contract? And so, it's probably subsidized through the co um, phone company. You buy their phone, a part of your contract, you get a Switch Lite, which is pretty dope. Last news item for this video, bro. Pokemon. Poke, 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 Pokemon. When asked by VG247, Pokemon's developer, um, producer, Junisi Masuda, was asked on um, how they're taking pretty much the response from fans. Some the biggest controversy with this game is not every Pokemon you're not gonna be able to play with all I just realized something. Was Del Fox gonna be in this game? I haven't seen anything about what's her um original form? Del Fox is the final form. Finnegan something like you know the little fox. Bro, that was my favorite Pokemon in XY, man. I'm a part of the raging Pokemon fan bandwagon. All right, this is what he said in response to the, the, the fans being upset, specifically to that issue. 
He's saying it's not necessarily, um, they were asking, did it make them rethink their approach to the game? And this is what he says. It's not necessarily that it's made us rethink per se, but what we are always looking at for the future is what we can do to make the most interesting game possible and make a more enjoyable, richer experience for the fans. He continued, for example, when we add new moves and abilities, we create a deeper experience for everyone to enjoy. This time around, we can also give people a greater attachment to the Pokemon that are in the game, which is something we think is very important. So we definitely, we don't have regrets about what we've done and he's also added that pokemon home is on the way if players are yearning to get all their pokemon in one place and so he said he has no regrets meaning he's confident in the final product of the game the game is looking cool pokemon drops at the um close to the end of november between pokemon and the switch light it's gonna sell like crazy bro I'm calling it right now. You heard it here first. Pokemon is going to sell like crazy. Who would have thought? All right, dudes. These are all of the news items for this video. But before I go, tonight with the sponsors, we're going to be playing Asphalt, Fortnite, probably some Overwatch, and I don't know what else. Probably some 2K. We might end it with some 2K with the sponsors on the Switch. If you want to join a dope Nintendo Switch gaming community, become a member of the OGC. The link's right there in the description on how to join and game with me every night. All right, dudes. What do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. Peace.